Hey Food Network, my name is Graham Howland. I'm 53 years old and I'm coming to you from Miami, Florida here at Coconut Grove Marina on my boss's yacht. I'm his personal chef. You should pick me for Pumpkin Wars because I'm going to win. Me, what I really want to do, I would love to take multiple pumpkins and make one carving out of all the pumpkins. Like stick them on rebar and then have like all the multiple pumpkins together to create like one big artistry of pumpkin carving. Not just a solo one, but a whole bunch grouped together to make one big collage. On the pumpkin, I usually let it dictate what it's going to tell me to do. And so I kind of like this stem, so I think I'll make it. Details I can do later. I only have three minutes. I would like to have three days because then I can do some of the real elaborate ones. But since this is just a quick video, no problem. Nice. <laughs> this is the kind of atmosphere I got to work in, you know? It's crazy. Anyway, that's just a quick one. <laughs> Very confident. Um, part of my uh, carving prowess is uh, two dimensional, I like to do relief. Uh, since I do work on uh, the motor vessel Mambo, uh, we have a logo, and so a lot of that goes into a lot of the carvings that I do. do. And so, uh, of course, for the M, I don't use a, a V channel knife. I use a, just a sharp knife, and I cut my own V. To me, it's a lot, a lot of the carvings that I do will be center, uh, centerpieces for trays, perhaps fruit trays or crudite. Um, I'll, I'll always have a, a centerpiece, a carved butternut squash, a carved eggplant, anything that's an apple. I love to carve apples. I do the classical bird of paradise. Um, just about anything. bunch of ideas that you know on, on a yacht I'm kind of limited to what I can do and, and stuff like that but uh, at home and for the kids I, I kind of explore and do new things I don't have a set realm I like two-dimensional three-dimensional I like um, where you can view the pumpkin from all around I like it from where you just carve away the skin and you can see the opaque light coming through I like where other times I'll do like um, perhaps a, a belfry with bats flying out of it and as the bats get up higher they're bigger and brighter um, I think it's a, a really cool visual thing and I tell you man I'd love to be on TV and doing the Food Network and the Halloween Wars would be awesome